Hey, this is the South Oregon Coaster. So we're here today at the John Dellenbach Dunes Trailhead. We're gonna do a little hiking today. And uh, John Dellenbach was a uh, Republican Dem uh, congressman. congressman from Oregon. And they named this trailhead after him. So we are going to get underway. More later. So plan at least four hours. Yeah, we're not doing that because we're not doing the whole loop. We're just going to, uh, we're just going to go for a little bit of a stroll today. Interpretive loop. Oh, we can walk the one mile loop in about 40 minutes. But be prepared. The big dunes and the variety of ecosystems may entice you to play away hours. Yeah, not today. So here we go. Here's a little storyboard on the trailhead. There we go. All right. Here's your little map. All right. And this is the start of the trailhead. stream down there. So a day use permit here at the John Dellenbach Trailhead is $5 and they have uh, pay envelopes and in the parking area with instructions on where to drop your pay off. This is the Southern Oregon coast at its finest. Today is a very beautiful day. Temperature is about 68 degrees right now, and it is September 3rd, Labor Day. Some little berries there in the bush. There's some more little berries. Whoa, hey. There we go. Yeah. All right. So we came out of the trailhead right there and it puts us out here. This is all sand dune.
been a lot of places around the United States and I'm not sure about the East Coast, but this is the only place I've ever seen where pine trees grow in sand. It's just weird. But it's interesting. And here's a little placard on, uh, or I don't know what you, sign, it's a sign on sign. some of the plants here in this area. Red fescue, seashore lupine, pearly everlasting, coast strawberry, and seashore bluegrass. All of those things in this beautiful environment. I'm not sure what kind of tree this is, but it is beautiful. Look at that, how it grows. With that red external and this white internal. That's just amazing. So one thing about the Pacific Northwest is that there are ferns everywhere. And growing up in Texas, you know, the only place that we saw ferns was in our house, in a pot where my mom would grow them. <laughs> so um, seeing all of these beautiful ferns just growing up out of the ground wild is... Yeah, it just it blows my mind. So that combined with all of the rest of the vegetation, I mean, Oregon in and of itself, the, the, the whole uh, western coast is nothing but green. Green, green, green. So um, it's just, it's beautiful. And it's amazing to be out in it and uh, share it with you folks. So... We're kind of wrapping up our, our uh, hike today. So we will have something else for you next weekend. Stay tuned. <laughs>